this is Cristina Luna of Café with Cristina and my webpage, hola, hola with H, cristinaluna.com. And here we are in Latinopedia time. Living encyclopedia. Buenos días. Buenos días. I have been thinking all week, wasn't Cristóbal Colón the one that discovered America sent by the Catholic, Isabela Católica y Fernando? That's right. Yeah? That's right. And, and I, I was wondering, why is she called Isabela Católica? Is she very Catholic? Or was very Catholic? Or what? Porque estoy confundida. Well, she was Catholic, but the reason she was Catholic was because she was raised in a convent. Oh, in a convent? You see, her stepbrother didn't want her ever to become queen. Hmm. So he took her and her mother and put them in a convent. <gasps> And you know, those days princesses were supposed to be married and stuff like that, but she loved the nuns. She said they were so wonderful, mm. away from all the intrigues of court and all the corruption and everything else. And so she wanted to become a nun. But her... It wasn't her destiny. No, it wasn't. And her stepbrother wanted her to be married to a degenerate knight because he said, this knight is so unpopular and so corrupt that if she marries him, she'll never become queen. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> and the night before the marriage, she went to the statue of the Blessed Mother and she prayed to God, please deliver me from this terrible marriage. I will dedicate my entire life to helping the church and the faith if I am delivered. Well, that night, this degenerate knight went out and not to be your, you know, some very nasty about it, but he was doing it with three women and he died of a heart attack. Oh my God, really? Did they <laughs> he died of a heart attack. Well, the next day when they were supposed to have the marriage, he Isabella said, he's dead, I've been freed. So on that reason, she was very Catholic. And you know, one of the nice things that she did, she abolished slavery for the Indians in 1503. Okay, now we know why Isabel la Católica was called Isabel la Católica. Thank you, I think I'm going to become a nun because the convent seems a very nice place to be. Mwah, mwah. Café with Cristina. And remember, we have a date on Sunday mornings on Café with Cristina 93.5 SBG from 8 to 9 a.m.